Good morning, it's Saturday and we have got up and come out to Park Run. Well, we were late actually, but Eddie's gone to do Park Run. Luna and I are just walking around. Oh, the runners are coming, so I'm going to move. Sorry about that. I had loads and loads of really quick runners running very quick behind me, so I had to get out of the way. <laughs> so yeah, we got up. Um, Eddie decided at seven he wasn't doing Park Run, so I switched the alarm off. Went to Luna out, got back into bed and was reading and then he decided he was doing it. I was going to go out and do my run this morning, but then it's a conundrum because if I do my run while he's doing this, sorry, Luna's chasing ducks. <laughs> Don't know if you can see her or not, there's ducks over there. Luna, Don't fall in there because I'm not going in after you. <laughs> That's a murky, murky canal. There's a whole load of them. What are you doing? Crazy dog. That's water down there, you don't want to go down there. You're right close to the edge, you need to come off there now. <laughs> I think I'm going to go back to the top path because she's making me extremely nervous. But yeah, so we got here and they've actually changed the route slightly from when Eddie last did it. So, but yeah, I was going to, it's about 20 minutes or so to drive here. And then it's a 20 minute drive back. And then part run takes Eddie about half an hour. So you're talking, you're out for over an hour. Um, I can't do my run quick. So I didn't want to do a part run. I wanted to do it, do it my own way, not feel like I'm racing. And um, we also would have wanted to walk Luna. So I just decided then just to bring her, give her a walk and then I'll do my run later or I might just go on the bike. But yeah. Is it nice? I'm going to drink the water now. Good girl. Is that nice? Have a drink. <laughs> Hi, so it's been a busy day. I got back from the run this morning and um, I think I showed you we had breakfast over there. So I had scrambled egg and toast and I give Eddie half a slice toast. So it was brown bread. So I was trying to make healthier choices for my breakfast. And then I came back and I was doing some more clothes bookkeeping because I'm just trying to chip away at it week by week. I think I finished one year now, I just need to check a few things and then get it submitted. And then uh, Ewan wanted to go to the optician, so I managed to get him an appointment for this afternoon. So I've just driven him over, I've been over at the opticians with him. And so I've got a McDonald's because he wanted a McDonald's and I decided that I was starving hungry, so I've treated myself to McDonald's. So I've got a chicken slept meal. This is a five chicken slept meal. Um, I no doubt will share some with Luna. And I've got some chips. And a couple of dips, I'm not sure if I'll have those. And I've got a Diet Coke, which I never normally drink Diet Coke, but just lately, I've been fancying it a little bit. So I've still got to go out for my run. I need to go down to Eddie's mum's because I need to sort her phone out. So I've still got quite a lot to do for today. I've edited a video and I'm just finishing the thumbnail off for that. So yeah, busy day. And I shall catch you later when I next do something interesting. I did buy two pies from our local, local butcher, so I might be having that for tea. So yeah, not great calories today, but it's Saturday. I'm finding it hard, but anyway, I shall catch you later. On my way back, we've been down to Eddie's mum's and I've been sorting her phone out and then we popped to Aldi because Chloe messaged to say they've got all their wool in. So I've managed to get some wool and we're on our way back now. So it's currently 25 to eight and it's getting dark. So it's very depressing. But yeah, so I'm going to go and see what there is for tea. I'm not really hungry. My selects that I had earlier, my McDonald's, has really filled me up. Um, I think I filmed, filmed that. I'm not sure. I, I'm starting to lose a plot. Um, but I had a select meal, which I shared with Luna. And then I've not had anything else since. I have got pie for tea. But like I said, I'm not really hungry at the moment. But we shall see. So yeah, nothing else to report on really. So I shall catch you later. Good morning, it is Sunday and I've only just picked up the camera and it's nearly one o'clock. Um, Kath picked me up and we went to visit my mum this morning, so I was over there 
got back and I've just made something to eat, which is the first thing I'm eating. Um, for some reason, my allergies are bad today. I'm not sure what's going on, whether there's something in mum's house or not that has triggered it, but my hay fever came up really bad. I hadn't taken a tablet when I got there and I've had to put eye drops in, so I'm a bit puffy looking, so I apologise. So breakfast is two potato waffles, two little sausages from M&S and an egg with a cup of tea. Oh, and I got this from Kath for starting my new job. There's a little mug to take to work, which is beautiful. I'm really, really excited to use that at work. And she also got me a little congratulations card, which is just over there on top of my coffee machine at the moment. And there he is in the wild eating his breakfast. <laughs> Good evening, it is currently, what time is it? Uh, 20 past seven. So since I saw you last, um, well, I showed you what I had to eat and then I went upstairs and read a bit of my book and then had a sleep, <laughs> which is most unlike me, but I felt like I got a bit of a headache and just thought, do you know what, I'm knackered. So I had a bit of a sleep, I did play on the Xbox and then I woke up and I finished my book. So I had a bit of a lazy afternoon and then decided, we took Luna out for a walk I decided I need to get my run in because I've been promising for the last two or three days I was going to go out for my second run and I hadn't done it. So I motivated myself to go out. It was raining and I love running in the rain. Got it done. It actually felt okay today, to be honest. Um, Couch 5k week two, day two done. I'm planning on doing just two runs from each week of Couch to 5k and seeing how I get on because obviously I've run before. So I'm hoping that muscle memory kicks in and I start to get like speed through it rather than having to do every single run but um and build up a bit quicker but we'll see how it goes if i have to repeat i have to repeat anyway um i got back i did a was it a 10 or a 15 minute post run stretch on off the peloton app and then i went and had my shower i've got dinner on so today for dinner we've got the pie that i bought from the butchers yesterday for yesterday's dinner i don't know if i mentioned this but i didn't end up eating any dinner last night ewan decided he wanted to order desserts in so i did have a white cookie dough but wasn't hungry enough for dinner, so I just had that, <laughs> which is really, really unhealthy, but it could have been worse. I could have eaten a dinner and that. So I just had that and then didn't want anything else. You know, that was my, my day done. So yesterday I had the scrambled egg on toast after park run when Eddie ran. Did I have anything after that? And then I had the McDonald's later on. And that was it until I had the cookie dough. So not a very healthy day, but it was Saturday, treat day Saturday. So this pie was supposed to be for yesterday's dinner. I wouldn't normally have pie necessarily um, the rest of the time because obviously it's not that healthy, but it's all about balance. I'm not ruling any foods, food groups out now. I'm determined to try and eat a normal balanced diet and maintain my calories that way and exercise and all the rest of it. So we'll see. So we've got a, I put half a lamb pie in and half a steak and ale pie because originally I bought two pies because Ewan was here and he fancied something different to me. I left two half pies in the fridge just in case. I don't know when he's coming home from work and Tom's away. So I've done two half. So Eddie and I will have a quarter of each pie each. I've got new potatoes. I've got homegrown carrots and I've got broccoli and peas. So hopefully I fill in dinner. I did buy a cornflake tart yesterday as well, which I haven't had any of so far. So I don't know whether I'll have any of that later, but it is what it is. I've got a cup of tea now. I'm just waiting for dinner to finish getting ready and then um, I'll be dishing it out. So I'm just watching a bit of YouTube whilst I'm waiting. So yeah, I'll hopefully remember to show you my dinner. Here's my dinner. So I've got some broccoli, peas, homegrown carrots, and some steamed new potatoes. I've got two pieces of pie and some gravy over the top. Good morning, it is Monday and I'm working from home today. I'm really tired. We had really heavy rain and a bit of thunder during the night and it kept disturbing Luna and I was so tired. She wanted to come on the bed, she wanted to go in her little house, she wanted to go in the bathroom, she wanted to go downstairs, she could not get comfortable, so it kept waking me up. So I ended up reading my book until about half two this morning. So when the alarm went off at seven, luckily I'm working from home today and not in the office because I get up at like half six, just before half six when I'm in the office. And that half an hour made a big difference, <laughs> but I am tired. But anyway, I'm working from home, just going through, we've had a few queries, just going through all of my notes and stuff, trying to consolidate everything that I've done over the last couple of weeks and try and get into my groove a little bit. Um, and I've got my breakfast and I'll show you what I'm having, just something really basic. So breakfast today is two slices of malted bloomer bread from Aldi. In fact, it wasn't Aldi, it was Lidl. And some Norpak lighter and just some blackcurrant jam. I haven't tracked the calories yet. 
Um, it's the first thing I'm eating today, but I just need to eat something. My stomach just feels empty. And I shall catch you later for lunch. Not sure if I've mentioned on the vlog or not. I can't remember where I've got to, but um, I go to Ireland this Wednesday for a family party. So I'm in Ireland from Wednesday until Sunday. Well, Sunday morning, first thing we'll come back. I'm not sure how much I'll be vlogging while I'm in Ireland this time, just because it is a family party and so I won't be filming that. That'll be like just private time. I shall see if there's anything interesting that I do in between times. I can imagine the weather's going to be dreadful <laughs> because Ireland is wet and windy at the best of times, but this time of year it's definitely going to be a bit of the, on the colder side. Um, but I'm not sure what we're going to do while we're there. I know my cousin has set a challenge. He wants me to make some jam for him while I'm there. So I might be doing that. <laughs> but other than that, I'm not sure. So, um, so yeah, I shall catch you later. Just been out for a walk. God, the change in weather is unbelievable. It is. It was slinging it down. And it was really windy and fairly chilly, actually. So, um, yeah, it feels like autumn's finally here. So for my lunch, I've been to the bakery. They hardly had anything left because I left it a bit late. But... I've just got a turkey and stuff in cob, so I'm not sure of the calories, but I'm just going to estimate it the best I can. It's just like a normal sliced turkey like you'd get out of a, a packet. So this is my lunch and I'll catch you later. Evening, it is 10 to 8 and I've been sitting down doing some work on the computer. I've been finishing off all of Chloe's tax stuff and... This is for the year 21-22, so I'm, I'm really, really knackered now, but I've almost finished it. I'm going to submit it tomorrow when she's here so she can check through the figures, but I've just been going through all of that, so ever since I finished work, so I'm really tired now. So Eddie's made dinner. We've effectively got the same pie we had yesterday. What? Nothing. What? Nothing. Just the same as yesterday. Well, it is the same as yesterday. I will um, show you what I'm having. So this is the same pie I had yesterday. Um, obviously a different portion, not the same one, eh, that. <laughs> I've got um, the rest of the carrots that I cooked yesterday that were left over. And this is some frozen mash that's an Ikea one that was in the freezer. And then there's just some gravy over the top. I haven't calculated the calories, um, but I'm not going to do that now. I know it sounds bad, but I'm just too tired. I haven't had a huge amount to eat today, so I'm just going to go with the flow and I shall catch you tomorrow. Good morning, it is Tuesday today and I'm in the office. Eddie's just doing washing behind me and I'm going to quickly have something to eat before I leave. It's currently 25 past seven, I've been faffing around for God knows how long. I got up at like half six and got my makeup and stuff done and um, I was going to make a sandwich for work but the bread's gone mouldy so that's a no go so I'm going to have to buy something. I haven't got anything else I can take easily. So I've decided to have some breakfast just to tide me over because when I have lunch at work, I tend to not have lunch till one. So it's, um, I mean, when I'm here, I'm wait working sometimes till two or three and it doesn't matter. But for some reason when I'm in the office, mentally, I think I need to eat. But I'll show you what I'm having. So I have got some um, 22 grams of the multigrain Rice Krispies and then I've got some lemon curd Yo Valley yogurt. I haven't worked calories out yet. Um, but yeah, it shouldn't be too many. I think um, the cereal is quite a small pack, so it's quite restricted in calories. So that's fine, and I shall catch you later. I'll try and remember to record what I have for my lunch. It all depends if I eat downstairs in the canteen or whether I eat upstairs or not as to what I do with recording my lunch. But I'll see how I get on, and I shall see you in a bit. Hi, just editing this video, excuse the gym kit, <laughs> I'm multitasking, um, and realised that I didn't record my food at the end of Wednesday, I can't even remember, oh, sorry, Tuesday, I can't even remember for the life of me what we had, um, but the next clip you see is me on my way to Ireland, so I just thought I'd put that in there because there was no real sort of clips to finish off Tuesday. I think Tuesday night was just manic because I had to try and pack. I think I got held up in traffic. There was all sorts going off. I might have popped to the shop as well, but yeah, it was it was a crazy night, so I just didn't get a chance to record anything. I really don't even remember what I had for dinner, but I know I wasn't particularly bothered about calories and stuff at this point, but I can't remember what I had. On with the video. She is in the wild. 
<laughs> good morning uh, good morning it is what day is it today thursday or friday friday so we flew over to ireland on wednesday and i haven't picked up my camera really to vlog I'm, i've done like a couple of meals and that's it we've had really nice family time and kath and i've just been having giggles and a good laugh but today my cousin has dropped us out on a trail and we're doing a walk and for some reason he thinks we need sticks so we're a bit <laughs> we're a bit worried about it but yeah we're doing a walk i've got my glasses which will turn black so i've just put them on my head but yeah i've got no makeup on kath's got no makeup on we're both barefaced we're quite a late night at my cousin's last night so my other cousins midnight we left. midnight yeah it was very late and very dark country roads so um we got up and got showered this morning but we're now doing a bit of a trek and then hopefully later we might go out shopping but i'm not really filming much because it's just quality family time um, if I see anything nice on the trail, I will try and film a bit. Oh look, there's a belly belt. Right, I shall see you in a bit. I don't know how well you can see that, I'm going to have to zoom in. It's walking towards us though. We've got a sheep walking towards us on this path. But this path, this Greenway path runs all the way through to the island and it's like a really long path for cycling and walking, it's beautiful. Oh well, that's nice, they're like little suitcases but for a seat. Oh yeah. Just there. The horn, and there's like a map and stuff over here. He's like minding his own business lot. He's on his track of his own. You don't want to come near me. Yeah, he's like, leave me alone. Where are you going, fella? You can't we did shut that gate properly, didn't we? Yeah. These sheep can get through and that not not that gate, but they'd be able to get through the other bit. Yeah. I'm going to look on maps to see how far it is to... It might tell you on here. So this is the Great Western Greenway, it's called, and it runs. And that's Akil Island, and it runs all the way through. All the way through to Westport. And Westport is the place we were yesterday.
put his hands up. Dad said donkeys are stupid. He said that if you want to go up a mountain, you take a donkey because a horse is clever and a horse will just refuse. But a donkey is stupid. I hope you're not hearing that donkey because it wasn't my opinion. Throwing apples in the fire. Oh, it smells, you can smell it. Can you smell the apples? Mm. Or is it just because I'm not holding them? Well, it could be because you're right next to it. Did it have that autumnal can candle smell? Oh, it smells quickly, got in there. Right, shut the door. Oh, yeah. Evening, <laughs> we are here for a tea. Um, we've come to the Ackle Island Hotel and we're meeting some family and we're going to have a nice meal. I'm just looking around because they're due to arrive any time now. Um, I'll just show you my view where I've parked. It looks so much further away, but this is the current view and it's gorgeous. And this is the hotel. And there's a little restaurant inside called Alice's, which is where everyone seems to go. We'll come in here again tomorrow for lunch. <laughs> so yeah, we've had a lovely day. We did the long walk this morning and then we went to Castle Bar and had a wander around TK Maxx and stuff there, just to see if there's anything different. We even went a wander around Aldi <laughs> to see if there's anything different to what we have. And there was. And there was a little bit, yeah. And then um, we sort of got back and just sort of chilled and read for a little bit. We didn't have a huge amount of time, so got ready and come out for the evening meal so I'm looking forward to having something to eat because I'm starving I've had nothing to eat apart from a bit of cake after we came back from our walk apart from breakfast this morning so not too bad <laughs> and I shall see you in a bit Thank you. 
Editing Julie back again. So that's the end of the video. I didn't record anything else the day we came back. Um, I was just shattered, to be honest, because it was a real long day. We we got up at about... I think we'd been to the party the night before. We didn't get in till about 12-ish, and then we had to be up again and out by 5 because our flight was really early, and it's about an hour and a half, two-hour drive. So really tired. Eddie and I went for breakfast, as you saw. I had the full English. Eddie had scrambled egg on toast. And then I think for tea... Eddie made a shepherd's pie or something like that. It was fairly healthy and really tasty. Didn't record any more footage. I just basically emptied my case out and got ready for the working week. So that was the end of the video. Hope you all enjoyed it. There was a few like very, very funny moments with my sister and we did have some real giggles and good time. Um, but I didn't want to be picking my camera up the whole way through. So I hope you understand that sometimes it's just nice to be in the moment. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video. I shall be back very soon with another one i've actually got last week's video to edit i don't know how much i've vlogged last week like i say i'm still in early days of my job so i've been a bit intermittent with vlogging and things but hopefully normal what do you call it normal system will be resumed or normal service will be resumed that's the word <laughs> very very soon so um yeah, thanks so much for watching. If you like the video, pop a like on it for me. Um, comment down below, as always. And if you haven't subscribed, if you could subscribe, that would be wonderful. And I shall see you very soon for another one. Bye.